Have you ever pondered, can spirituality exist without religion? If so, you're not alone. Enter the world of Sam Harris and his seminal work, Waking Up, A Guide to Spirituality Without Religion. This isn't just another book on spirituality. It's a journey that ventures beyond the constraints of religious doctrines. Harris, a neuroscientist, philosopher, and longtime meditator, invites us on his personal quest. Through his eyes, we explore the intriguing landscape of spirituality, untouched by the footprints of traditional religious practices. He proposes that spirituality, often associated with religion, can exist independently, welcoming everyone, regardless of their beliefs or lack thereof. Harris's journey to spirituality doesn't require a deity or dogma. Rather, it encourages personal exploration and growth. It's a journey many of us might find familiar, a quest to find deeper meaning and connection in our lives. Like Sam Harris, many are on a journey to find spiritual fulfillment without the dogma of religion. How can science and spirituality coexist when they seem to be at odds with each other? This is a question that often boggles the mind. In the second chapter of Sam Harris' book, Waking Up, A Guide to Spirituality Without Religion, he seeks to answer this very question by bridging the gap between these two seemingly contradictory realms. Harris emphasizes the profound role of consciousness in our lives. He suggests that our awareness, our very sense of self, is a vital aspect of our existence that should not be overlooked by science. This consciousness, Harris posits, can be explored and understood through practices such as mindfulness and meditation. But how does this align with science? Harris argues that these practices don't negate scientific principles. Instead, they offer us a unique lens through which to examine our inner lives. Mindfulness and meditation allow us to delve deep into our thoughts and emotions, to better understand our reactions and responses, and ultimately to achieve a state of self-transcendence. This self-transcendence, according to Harris, is not a mystical or supernatural phenomenon. It is a state of consciousness that can be reached through introspection and self-exploration, and it is a state that science can and should seek to understand. So what Harris proposes is a marriage of science and spirituality, a union where these two realms not only coexist, but complement each other, providing a more comprehensive understanding of ourselves and the universe. Science and spirituality, rather than being in conflict, can work together to deepen our understanding of the self and the universe. What if the key to true spiritual enlightenment lies within our minds? Sam Harris, in his groundbreaking book, Waking Up, A Guide to Spirituality Without Religion, suggests just that. He turns our attention to mindfulness, a practice that many of us may have heard of, but perhaps not fully understood. Mindfulness, as Harris explains it, is the art of being present and aware. It's about inviting ourselves into the present moment, fully experiencing it, and not letting our thoughts wander to the past or future. We all know how easy it is to become lost in our thoughts, ruminating on the past or worrying about the future. But Harris suggests that true understanding, and indeed, true spirituality, comes from being fully present. The transformative power of mindfulness lies in its ability to facilitate a deeper understanding of ourselves and our experiences. As we become more aware of our thoughts, feelings, and sensations, we start to see them for what they truly are, transient and ever-changing. This realization can be liberating, freeing us from the grip of negative thought patterns and emotional turmoil. Harris argues that mindfulness is not just a tool for stress reduction or a trendy wellness practice. It's a pathway to spirituality, a route to understanding the mysteries of consciousness and our place in the universe. Through mindfulness, we can discover a sense of spirituality that is grounded in our own experiences rather than in religious doctrine. So what does it mean to wake up in a spiritual sense? This is where we find ourselves after a deep dive into Sam Harris's book, Waking Up, A Guide to Spirituality Without Religion. In essence, the book tells us that spirituality is a universal human experience. It's not confined to the walls of a church, a mosque, or a temple. It's a journey of self-discovery that we can embark on, regardless of our religious beliefs or lack thereof. Harris underlines the importance of consciousness in this journey. By being aware, by practicing mindfulness, we can explore the depths of our spirituality. And this exploration isn't blind. 
It's guided by the beacon of science, shedding light on the intersection between the tangible and the intangible. In the end, waking up encourages us to explore spirituality in our own terms, reminding us that the journey towards enlightenment is as unique as we are.